Noise-canceling earbuds. How do they remove background noise? Let's join Professor Skeptic's Zoom session to find out. Uh, Mr. Drummer. BJ Drummer. Yeah, I'll teach him. Sure, I think BJ was using his noise-canceling earbuds. I never wear earbuds to a meeting. Uh, that's good, Mr. Nerdly. You need all the help you can get. I must have gotten disconnected. I disconnected you. You weren't paying attention. Uh, uh, sorry, sir. Sir, can you explain how noise-canceling earbuds work? I'll share a short video. Many people walk around with listening devices in their ears. Headphones, earphones, earbuds, ear pods, ear pods. I'll use earbuds for my discussion, but it applies to all of these. Most of these are simply speakers, but some are noise-canceling devices. How do they work? Earbuds have speakers that play music, etc. Noise-canceling earbuds have microphones, too, and they detect the background noise or ambient sound. Internal electronics actually add sound to nearly cancel out the background sound. The technical term here is attenuate. Attenuation is achieved by a process called destructive interference. Let blue be the music that you want to hear. Let green be the noise that you don't want to hear. If you add the two together, you get the brown time trace. This is without any kind of cancellation. Let red be the inverted noise. Notice that it's 180 degrees out of phase with the background noise. I chose black as the attenuated noise. This is what you hear when you add the noise and the inverted noise together. They nearly cancel each other out, but it's not exactly zero due to phase shifts and other problems. Now we add back the music that you want to hear. When you add these together, the purple is the music that you finally hear. They hear it is by itself. It's not exactly the same as the music you want, but it's pretty good. In summary, noise canceling devices work by adding sound that is 180 degrees out of phase with the background noise. Background noise is inverted and attenuates the noise by destructive interference. The music finally heard is nearly the same as the desired music, but the noise is not completely canceled due to errors in generating the inverted sound. But noise cancellation is no excuse for not paying attention. <laughs> uh, thank you, sir, for that explanation. It's like fighting fire with fire. Yeah, sort of, but that's not the best analogy, Mr. Nerdly. It's more like fighting sound with more sound. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, but sure, does that extra noise damage our ears? Of course not. You actually hear less noise with the noise cancellation on. Uh, thank you, sir. Uh, yeah, and next time, Mr. Drummer, pay attention. Yeah. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos.